Metro is a fascinating game to me. I can't quite explain it. Like, I'm not sure if it's the post-apocalyptic environment with the snowy surface, the dark and desolate Metro system, you know, like the title of the game, or just the creepy nature of the enemies and these knockoff Slendermans. Who the f*** is that guy? My history with the series is, I first played Metro 2033 like three years ago, and I was blown away by it. So that led me to get Metro Last Light a year later, and I was double blown away by it. But at the time, I couldn't play Metro Exodus because running that game on my computer would have caused a nuclear explosion in real life, and therefore make the game start with based on a true story. Since then, I've made my computer a bit better so I could actually run the game now, but I haven't had the time yet so it's just been sitting in my library for a while. I'll play it eventually. But when I first played Metro 2033, I played it on the easiest difficulty, partly because I was new to horror so some of the levels would make me tremble more than an earthquake, but also because I sucked. So I knew a perfect idea. How about I replay Metro 2033 after 3 years, but put it on the hardest difficulty. So I did just that. If you don't know, the Ranger Hardcore difficulty gets rid of all your HUD elements, it doesn't even tell you what you can interact with, and increases the damage of everything, so the enemies can kill you faster, and you can kill them faster. So that means because of the dark environments, you'll have no idea who just trickshotted you across the map. So with that in mind, let me show you how that went. Spoiler alert, it wasn't that bad. So I'll be playing the hardest difficulty, uh, it's called Ranger Hardcore. However, in the options, there's another difficulty thing here. I don't know what it does, but I'm gonna put it on Hardcore to make it as hard as possible. That's the goal. And there we go, Ranger Hardcore. Let's do it. Open the gate, I'll cover. Where do I open it? Should be right here, no? Oh, they don't give you a prompt, okay. Yeah, demons. Are they the same demons from Doom? This looks like the cleanest hospital in Chernobyl. Really, you leave me with just a pistol? Wow. Okay, I'm curious, hold on a minute. See, I'm supposed to be able to press tab for this, but um... Also, uh, quick saving doesn't look like it's a thing here. Okay, well, if I die, I'm gonna have to replay like seven hours. Yo, this is not a concert. Again, this is not a concert, yo. Stop exchange. I can exchange bullets for actual bullets. Is that how that works? Let me take your gun from your back. So why does everyone get an AK except for me? I got the bastard gun. Okay, since we pulled out the guns, I'm guessing, uh... Wait, where'd all my ammo go? We got Slenderman here. Spam E or something, I don't know what the button is. <laughs> he just disappeared. I can hear the weapon wheel that's supposed to be there, but it's not there. You help me get to dry, I'll give you my AK when we get there. Deal. No. Good. Wait, I said no. Okay, pressing tab does bring up the throwing weapons menu inventory, but it is invisible. What the fuck? You get closer. Can you take down the patrol? Really? You're just gonna hide like a wuss? I gotta be sneaky around here. Uh... What? Working as intended. Trust me, the last time I played this, it was not as buggy as Cyberpunk 2077. Okay, you die pretty quick. One blast. Two blast. You didn't even die. I hate these guys. Oh my god. I kind of want to go get that. You know what? I'm doing it. Oh, so you can buy guitars and... And nightmare inducing dolls. I would take this one, it looks to be the best one, but uh, I don't have enough bullets for that. So, everything is so expensive, just like real life. It's the year 2033, right? Um, which is 10 years in the future from right now, but we're still living with ancient ass tech. Like, what is this? Oh, so I I've heard your filters run out pretty quickly on this mode. Oh, this was the key. And I got... I don't even know what I got. Oh, run. Run, you... Oh, here are the traps I fell for. There's a lot of them as well. And don't walk into them. You got that. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. Yeah, working as intended. Burn these spiders that just phase through the roof. Okay, this might be better. Do they see my laser sight, though? 
That's the question. We shine it right in your eye. And he doesn't see it. That's good. I want to try to do this sneaky, but I know that's going to take forever. And at some point, they're going to they're gonna see me, right? Who's there? Oh, I knew it. Okay, I'm dead. I didn't even know you can go through here. Okay. Oh, he did. Ooh, there's so much ammo here. I'm sure I'm loaded on that. So you you can look at your time. I don't know. I don't know why you'd want to. Spooky. Throwing flashbang. Super spooky. I mean, so far I think this difficulty is more fun than the regular difficulties. Okay, well. No, not again. Please no. Okay, well, come on now. This is the one part that I've died like 40 times on. Again already? Okay, maybe this was a mistake. You know, I read on one website they said that you can kill most monsters in like one or two hits. Yeah, no. Oh, really? Where were you like five minutes ago? We sent a demolition squad there, but they never came back. And there is no one else we could send. Oh, let me guess. They're gonna make me do that. Are those the guys? Oh, shit. I hope this is where I have to plant it. Yes? Or no? Do I put the bomb here? Oh, here it is. Why was it over here? Didn't they say the left side? Oh, sh Okay. That caught me off guard. Are you leaving me here? You know I have no ammo, right? Or it looks like I'm on my own in here. Or I've already been caught. Ooh, what is this? <laughs> but too much money. Too much money. Too much money again. And too much. You know, I'm not doing any of that. A site could be good, but... Man, all this is so expensive and I'm, and I'm broke, you know? Oh, there's the book that this game is based on. Nice easter egg. Oh. Or do I have to sneak around here? So you know that light that tells me whether I'm visible or not? Good thing, I'm like a, a ghost. They can't see me, even though they have lights on their forehead. Uh, what was the button again? <laughs> it's been it's been two days since I last played. I don't actually know where I'm supposed to go. They, they didn't tell me. Um, what do I do here? And, and you don't do that. Oh, maybe maybe turn this off. I think there should be a path somewhere over here, or not? Oh, yeah, I meant to do that. We have an airsoft gun. I don't know if this gun is actually worth it. You know, to make it interesting, I'll take it. Oh, shit. trial and error. Trial and error. Oh, they found me. Damn it. Oh, I'm mega screwed, aren't I? Let me shine a laser right in his eyes. And, and that laser duplicates as you zoom in. Bruh. There we go. Oh, he... he found me. Okay, just gotta take this nice and slow. No, this is not going perfect. If you could come down here, it would make my job a whole lot easier. Oh, fuck. What is that sound? You know, I think to actually do good in this difficulty, you have to pay attention, which I'm not doing. Why did I take my gas mask off? I didn't even press a G. Why do I keep taking my... I probably didn't have to stealth it. Oh, we, we don't talk about that. These guys are hogging all the oil lamps. Um... We like to call these features. I don't remember this part of the game, but... Oh, okay, I'm done. Oh, we got Superman over here. 
or Batman. So it looks like in Metro, it's just a day in the life to be saved by random people like every two minutes. Oh, that ain't cool. You have to use A and D to move left and right. What the fuck? Oh, I'm gonna die instantly. Oh, this is finicky controls if I've ever seen them. Oh, you just die, okay. Oh, this overheats. I forgot about that. Oh, I'm so dead. Really? Did that kill me again? Oh my god. These controls don't help. Okay, do I have to shoot these guys if I just... Okay, I do. So yeah, that's about how it went. I didn't play the whole game, by the way, because I'm pretty sure the game is like six hours Bruh. long. I'll be honest, though, it wasn't as terrible as I first thought it was going to be. Like, I was thinking it's going to be as hard as Elden Ring on easy, but no, it was alright. I only had big trouble in just a few sections, and most of that trouble was my garbage aim. I'd actually say that this difficulty is the definitive way to play Metro. It perfectly encapsulates the survival horror, because you don't know how much ammo you have, you don't know what equipment you have, you don't know if you're even aiming straight, and you have no idea how long you have until you suffocate outside. So I'd say if you haven't tried to play Metro like this, go try it. It's pretty good. But anyways, bye.